Welcome to When Nerds Learn to Fly. Five years ago on our anniversary, we were in Florence. Both of us had a pretty bad cold. We were taking cold medication. It was starting to drizzle. It was cold. We were tired. We were starving. And we came upon this little pizzeria. I don't know if it was just because it was such a comfort to get inside where it was warm and dry, a mixture of the wine and the cold medicine, but this pizza was the best pizza we had ever had in our life. There we go. Oh, it's video. We are at where we had eaten five years ago. So we tracked down this place. We weren't sure exactly where it was. No maps or anything. No maps or anything. We found it. <laughs> Best pizza in town. It is a pretty good little restaurant. I have to admit this time around, the pizza didn't have quite the effect on us. It did the first time. That first time... It seemed like it was the end-all, be-all, so this trip, we spent a little extra time trying to find this restaurant, and kind of proud of ourselves because we went almost straight to it with no map and only one memory from five years ago. It uh, was a wonderful experience, and we told the gentleman that was operating the restaurant that we'd been married 15 years ago in the Palazzo Vecchio. He said he had also been married in the Palazzo Vecchio. For Italians to get married in the Palazzo Vecchio, it's not that big of a deal because that is their town hall, and that is where all legal marriages are initially done, and then people go to have a symbolic ceremony or a religious ceremony. We ate at our fav favorite pizza joint here, and as you can see, it's coming back on me. Um, <laughs> had a jug of wine, and now we are going to head to the Palazzo Vecchio, where we were married 15 years ago. Oh, and the guy at the pizza joint, he ended up giving us a calendar. He was married to the Palazzo Vecchio, too. Always an adventure. Yeah, that's us. <laughs> <laughs>